Something spooky this way comes, Nerdist readers, and it's going to be me talking to Jack Black. So get ready to say Nerdist and die, because we're about to talk Goosebumps with R.L. Stein himself. Well, not himself, the guy playing him. You get the picture. Anyway, just keep watching. So, uh, obviously, you're playing R.L. Stein, and uh, the Goosebumps books I remember when I was younger... Uh, See, I, I'm a bit of, I was a bit of a coward, so I didn't make it through, but I, you know, they're a great way to introduce kids to horror without traumatizing them. Exactly. Is the movie going to stay true to that spirit, or are we going to see some kids leaving in tears? No, no, that's why, that's why I wanted to make it. I got a six-year-old and an eight-year-old who love scary movies, but they, they, don't, they, they have a lot of caveats. They're like, is there blood? Is there, what? They want to know that they're not going to be like, mentally wounded and have like uh, nightmares for weeks so we watch mostly old scary movies like frankenstein invisible man the werewolf from 1930s yeah like classic universal monsters stuff exactly. like that. exactly so those are like they're, they're like scary ish mm -hmm. they're not they're not gonna freak the kids out yeah. but they're well made and, and fun and sometimes funny that's nice. and so that's the vibe we were going with for this movie we're not shooting in black and white but it's like it's uh, it's scary and funny, but not uh, not too much. So nice, nice. Were you? Uh, have you? Obviously, I imagine you read up on some of the books. Um, but uh, have you spoken to R. L. Stein? Did he? Uh, have you tried to mimic his mannerisms at all, or is this more of like a exaggerated portrait? Exactly. Well, yes, of course. I I spoke <laughs> with R. L. before we did the movie. We went out and had lunch with him in New York. Me and the director, Rob Letterman, and uh, sweet guy, very funny and and uh, smart and. And I said to him, you know, if, if there's anything you, you think that we should do differently with the script, let, let us know because we want to, you know, stay true to your sensibility. But he was into it. He liked the direction we were going, didn't have to do any major rewrites. And uh, he liked that I was playing him. And uh, he was okay with the fact that I was going to change it up. I took a lot of liberties mm -hmm. because I needed to be creepy and, yeah. and, uh, and a little uh, foreboding. I have a little danger Ooh. in my soup. And... Uh, and he understood that, you know, because he's just a sweet guy. Yeah. And, I, and that wasn't going to work mm -hmm. for the way I was going to play R.L. Stein. Exactly. I feel like most people that wind up writing horror turn out to be like really sweet, cuddly people. Yeah, that's the thing. You expect him to be... Like this tortured... Uh, yeah. Yeah. You expect the, the darkness to be there, mm -hmm. for the temperature to go down in the room when he enters it. <laughs> but it couldn't be further from the truth. Yeah. Uh, well, a movie like this it makes me think that it, the set would be a ripe place to play pranks on people, scare the ever-loving daylights out of your uh, castmates. Was there any of that going on behind the scenes? Well, Ryan, who plays uh, the character Champ, he, he's a kid who's Ameri uh, He's a great, amazing actor from the, the movie, uh, if you saw um, uh, Super 8, mm -hmm. he's one of the kids from oh, that nice. movie, and he's uh, a prankster. He was doing this thing to everybody on the movie where he would sneak up behind you and like put uh, a little tiny leaf in your ear <laughs> <laughs> mother f father and uh so he was the only one that was really kind of freaking people out on purpose mm -hmm. but uh yeah i didn't i didn't uh i didn't pull any pranks i'm sorry to say it's all good there's always uh there's always goosebumps too for that that's true yeah um, is there going to be a Goosebumps-themed haunted house at a Festival Supreme? That's a very good question. Thank you for asking. There is going to be a haunted house. It's, it's like a haunted house carnival mm -hmm. at Festival Supreme, but it's not going to be uh, Goosebumps-themed, but it will be scary and it will be funny. So, kind of? Nice. Yeah. I got one last question for you. What are you afraid of? What am I afraid of? I, I'm afraid of crazy people. Yeah. yeah, probably. If probably. you got a screw loose, if I sense that you might be not all there, I'm fascinated and I'm drawn to you, but I'm also sc a little scared and worried too. Yeah, maybe watch through the uh, one-way mirror instead. Exactly. Cool. Thanks a lot, man. Thank you. Cheers. Sir. <laughs>